shot of one. First and foremost, I want to give our praise, glory, and honor, glory to Yahweh, Lord Shem, Yahweh Shah, Lord Shem, will come with us. No honor to the Apostle Hills and Great Hills, no. No respect to the brother teaching and preaching the truth all over the world worldwide. Come back here to give another lesson. You know, this is going to be uh, based on a random lesson that's, uh, you know, off the spirit. And I don't have a specific title for it yet, you know, but whatever the title is going to be, it's going to be at the end of this lesson. Uh, you know, as we are, uh, you know, uh, pro pro close to almost the end of this year, you know, we have, uh, you know, a lot of prophecies that, that took place, that, it, that is taking place right before your very eyes. And the reason why, uh, you know, the hand of the Lord, you know, on to prophecy because the scripture tells us that the spirit of Yahweh of Mashiach is the spirit of prophecy. And, and, and to be a man of the Lord, you have to go through all the wise counsel of Yahweh Mashiach. You know, you got to you got to you got to bring all of it out. You just can't you know bring out pieces and pieces of what you want to bring out. You got you got to uh, bring out uh, all the counsel of the Most High. And that's, and that's what we got to do in these last days because of, uh, because we got a lot of things and events that are going on and it has to be filtered, you know, through the scripture. You know, there's no if and supposed to about it, man. You know, it has to be filtered, you know, through the scriptures. You know what I'm saying? Because, uh, you know, the fact of the matter is that, you know, we are so and we're pretty close at, at the end of his kingdom. You know, and, and we gotta we gotta uh, declare all the counsel of uh, Yahweh by Shem Yahshah. We gotta uh, declare all his wonderful words, man. You know, uh, 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 so like the way, you know, just getting started. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead. <coughs> so my tablet's about to load up. I'm gonna go ahead and start bringing out bring out some scripture. How the very important, you know, to feed the sheep. The very important to bring out a uh, uh, scripture. To substantiate, you know, your points. Because you, you can have points all day, but if it, if it can't be backed up by scriptures, it cannot be validated. You know, and, and we can get it with scripture. Paul said, he said in the scriptures, you know what I'm saying, when, you know, he was uh, giving his speech for his uh, time that he, he was on the party, he was going to head, put, head to uh, Rome to be tried. You know, this is what he said, this is Acts chapter 20, and we're going to go ahead and uh, go ahead and read verse 27. You know, and, and it reads, for I have not sure to declare unto you all the counsel of Yahweh. And that was the man of the Lord do, man. You know what I'm saying? He declared all the counsel. You know, whether it counts as good, bad, or ugly. You know what I'm saying? We got to uh we got to give you all all the uh word all the words of Yahweh by him out shot. And, and we can't hold nothing back. Because we hold something back. The scripture tells us that you know it could be blood upon our hands. If we, if we held anything back, you know, but when we, when we declare all the counsel of the Most High, and, and guess what, you know what I'm saying, blood is no longer on our hands, man, because guess what, we, we declare the counsel, we declare everything that, that the scripture say, say to the blood to the spirit, man, you know, and when we see, you know, events that's taking place that according to the scripture, we do lessons on it, and we fear to read through the scripture. You know what I'm saying? That's how, it, and, and that's how you are, uh, you, know, you know, that's how you understand it, uh, about prophecy because, you know, 
you understand my prophecy because it's good to tell it. You know, as I said before, the spirit of Yahweh shall mock God is the spirit of prophecy. That's the reason why we go, uh, we go to scripture, man. You know what I'm saying? But I got all the counsel because it, uh, because, uh, you know, how about you know, shall command us to do so, man. You know what I'm saying? You can't be scared to bring out the truth and hold you to not but the truth. Because if you do, they you know as Christian said, you uh they hold you hold back, you know what I'm saying? You hold back, you know, you hop out shooting out shot, not gonna have no pleasure in you, man. You know what I'm saying? Every why you got to bring out all the counsel, really, you know. People here are whether they forbear. But you know what I'm saying, it's it not our job, you know, to try to make Come to the truth, man. You know what I'm saying? It's good to say, tell us, you know what I'm saying? We just teach the word and, and spirit y'all about seeing how it's on the job, man. You know what I'm saying? That spirit don't do the job. We just, we just teach it, man. That's, that's, all, that's all we command to do is to teach. And the priest can how about seeing how it's You know what I'm saying? You know, they're trying to teach scripture. Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a part of you knowing you're being a man. You know you have a shot. You know what I'm saying? Because you have to, you know, it's part of being, 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 uh, being a teacher, man. You got to bring out prophecy. And then that's what these uh, wacky, tacky Christians, they're afraid to do, man. They, they, they're afraid to bring out all the counsel, man. Uh, they didn't know they bring out all the counsel, you know, you got to cut them about their wickedness. You know, that's the reason why you got Christians, they, they, uh, uh, they continue to, uh, you know what I'm saying, uh, ignore everything. Even when you bring out the truth, they, they, they ignore everything that you said, and, and they go off their emotions. And the most high don't, the most high don't go their way, man. He, he doesn't feel like that. Revelation chapter 19 and then verse 10 it reads and I fell at his feet to worship him and he said unto me see thou do or not for I am or I am thy fellow servant and of thy brethren and have a testimony of Yahweh worship the most high for the testimony of Yahweh is the spirit of prophecy and then Testimony how shall my shot is spirit of prophecy man. And, and that's the reason why we go into prophecy. How that that the spirit of your by Jim Rao Shah, man. You bring out all the counsel of the most high. You know, and, and that's part of the that's part, that's part of the counsel, man. You bring out the prophecy. You, you look at what's going on in the world today and and, and get what you feel through it through the scriptures. You know, no if and bust about it. You know, you see what's going on in, in, in the world today. You go out and you feel through it through the scriptures. You feel through the word of Yah about Shem Al Shah. You know, you know, you feel it's a lot you feel through the theme of what's going on today through the scriptures. And then and that's how you know what what we had, you know, you know, uh the corner prophecy, man, because we go through the scriptures. And and, and what we see in the spirit, man. Bring it out because scripture said, you know, what you see in secret, you know, you, you, you preach upon the housetop, you know, roughly paraphrase. You know, what you're doing, you're bringing out all the counsel of the Most High, man. And, and you, you're not scared to bring out all the counsel. You're not you're not scared to declare the mighty works of your house by the Shemile Shah. Because you know, well, you know for a fact that the, that the counsel of the Most High, man, that, that, uh, that, be used to wake up the elect, you know, and, and, and that's just what it is, man. You know, and we have to bring, we have to learn how, you know, through spirit to bring out, bring out uh, everything. Because you know what, we, 
It's the end of the day, the men of the Lord don't want no blood on it. The reason why they, they bring out everything. You tell them to bring out something, guess what? They bring it out. You know, whether you hear or whether you forbear, you know, you bring it out. You know, you don't, you don't, you don't care about feelings, you don't care about emotions. But, but what you care about most importantly, they let the Israel run away go. Because we know that two thirds of our people are not going to wake up. They're going to reject this wise counsel of the Most High. And that's the reason why the fact of mind that two thirds of our people are going to be destroyed because they heard the words of the Most High. Too. You know, it's people us locking through and serving the prophets, man. They heard the word. And you get know what? And they cast it behind them. You know what I'm saying? They, they, uh, you know what I'm saying? They want to hang on the white man, white man Jesus. You know what I'm saying? They want, they want to hang on their Christianity. They read why they reject the truth. You know, they read why when they heard the counsel of the Most High, they rejected the true counsel now, because they they don't want to hear the true counsel of the Lord to tell them to repent and come back to to the Lord, man, come back to Yahweh Shem Yahushua, and to uh, put off all uh, their uh, they sin and their wickedness and, and to. Uh, to be converted. Our people, they, they, they hate the truth, man. You know, and they hate the counsel of the Most High. You know, with that, I pray that the list will edify. I'm going to give all praise. Give glory and glory unto Yahweh, by Shem, by Shem, by Shem, and Tapadash. The Bible said, Apostle Hells and Great Mills come. I never respect to the brother teaching and preaching the truth all over the world worldwide. See you again with another lesson real soon, Yahweh, Shalom.